hi welcome back to my channel it's Krista from Hebert's Down Home if you're new here welcome be sure to click the subscribe button down below today we're grocery shopping again with our family of eight we go through quite a bit of food grocery haul videos I tried to do a once a month grocery haul and it worked okay um, I didn't feel like I I felt like we ended up in the store quite a bit back in the store quite a bit I just don't think I'm quite that organized I know there are tons of large family moms that are able to do the once a month shopping and that it works for them but it just doesn't work for us so I'm going back to two week hauls because I actually think I save more money that way so um, over the holidays we had a death in the family and so we ended up with a lot of food coming to our house so we didn't use some of the things on our meal plan so this is kind of just a catch-up grocery haul to to kind of add to what we've already got we're kind of using up our pantry items and our freezer items that we have still available to us from our last month's grocery haul and we're just going to kind of fill in the gaps so today i am going first of all to walmart this morning and you're going to see that in this first uh, video and then we're going to have a part two where we go to aldi's and sam's so i'm going to tell you what my meal plan is for the week and then we'll do we're heading off to walmart so this so this is for the next two weeks and i'm just going to tell you our supper plans we do a rotation for breakfast and lunches with the kids um and and i'm just going to tell you what our supper plans are our rotation from breakfast and lunches stay the same so if you look at our last grocery haul video you can see what those are here's the meal plan for the next couple of weeks we're going to do wicked white chili uh, meatloaf chicken chimmies stir fry homemade pizza bacon wrapped chicken pork roast lazy lasagna salmon patties Tuscan cream chicken and then I have a couple of fill-in meals where um, we will be going to grandma's or going to other gatherings and so I don't have stuff on there for those although um, I still am gonna have to take stuff so I need to kind of figure that out quickly what I'm gonna do with that so anyway that's kind of the meal plan for the next couple of weeks and um, we're headed off to Walmart next okay I'm gonna get a pioneer woman coffee cup. I don't drink coffee, but for my hot drinks in the morning, I just thought it would be pretty and fun. So I think I like this one. Those other ones are very big. Way too big, I think. I think this will work. I have to buy more cat food because we're feeding skunks at our house. So buy another bag of cat food. Hopefully we can only feed the cats this time. Walmart for this two-week haul for our family of eight to fill in food for the next couple of weeks. Like I said, um, this is kind of a fill-in haul because we had some food left over from our big grocery haul in December um, when we had uh, lots of food brought in and so we didn't end up using it. So anyway, the total is $156.82 from Walmart, but I would say about $15 of that is clothing, so I take that out. 
but I do, as most of you know, um, include household items in my grocery budget. So $156.82 for Walmart, and then um, this afternoon, this will be in another video, um, we will be going to Aldi's and Sam's. So then we'll kind of round out this two week shopping. So I will show you what all I got at Walmart. So I have conditioner, lotion, soap, and um, toothpaste. I got my Pioneer Woman mug, which I'm excited about. It's beautiful, makes me smile. I got a couple of notebooks for me that I needed. Um, I have black beans and tomato sauce. I like to keep a couple small cans of tomato sauce on hand. I always buy the large cans at Sam's, but sometimes I don't want to open a huge can for just a little bit of tomato sauce. Um, I got bananas. I think it said eight pounds of bananas is what this was. Uh, baked Tostitos. The um, low carb tortillas for me and Joseph's Pitas for Bentley and Monty who are on plan as well. The Ghirardelli um, baking cocoa. I find that this cocoa makes everything uh, Trim Healthy Mama taste yummy that's chocolate. It just has a better flavor for me. So um, not so bitter and I really like that. So uh, mustard, we were just out. Truvia, which is um, an on plan uh, natural sweetener. I think that Truvia is, oh, I'm not gonna say it right, guys. Erythrol and Stevia blend. I can't say that right. Um, anyway, and then I have raspberry tea and peach tea. These are the two teas that I like to make my different drinks with. Um, I brought some cream cheese, third less fat, uh, cottage cheese, a couple of containers of that, some two sour creams, um, a zesty Italian, a tiny one because I need it in a recipe for a potluck that I'm making. So anyway, uh, biscuits, and I make buy these for, hang on, Monty's calling me from work. Hi. Hi. Hi, people. Okay, let me finish my video. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I buy these um, home style biscuits. The kids make mini pizzas out of them for lunch. I bought some whole wheat flour. Um, I'm going to try this new brand, Prairie Gold. It's non GMO. Um, this is to make, oh, muffins and stuff for the kids. Um, I have okra. I have peas. Um, uh, turkey sausage, I bought two of those, a green pepper, and of course the cat food to hopefully feed cats and not skunks. So that is what I got today at Walmart. So that is my Walmart haul for today. I will pop up the next videos with my Aldi's and Sam's um, haul in a couple of days. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.